Hello viewers, and welcome to Let's Play Together, The Evil Within. Hello. <laughs> so, same team, from the same team that brought you Alien Isolation comes what I hope is a really good survival horror game, because I've been jonesing for one since Resident Evil 4. Yeah, this has been on our list for a while, and um, I'm pretty excited about this one too, so... Here's hoping. Um, and this will be blind, much like Alien Isolation was. I should stop referencing that. It's going to make this LP dated. But uh, anyhow. Well, the, I just want to point out that it does say continue there. Uh, we did do a little playtest to make sure that graphics and stuff worked. Because this thing booted up at 30 FPS for some We're reason. like, what? Console Y? Yeah. <laughs> so, so, hopefully. Uh, th and we all do up with the DLC. And because apparently that ties into the story... We are going to tackle the DLC after the main game. Okay. But first of all, let's get... Go I don't have any autosave data. Well, yeah, from the playtest. Oh, that's right. Okay, the center mark is barely visible. But, oh, you know what? For the sake ah. of the viewers? Yeah, for the sake of the viewers, I'm going to leave it a little bit brighter there. Also, I saw that wheelchair. Don't think I wasn't paying attention. It's one of the rogue wheelchairs from Silent Hill 4. That makes sense. Okay. <laughs> so. Uh, don't be a pussy. Weak and fearful. Auto aiming by default. More ammo than normal. Standard difficulty. Challenge and overcome your fears. All right. Well, we can't start any higher than that. So. Chapter cheery. one. Cheery. An emergency call. That is like super cheer. Wait, it's moving. That's the loading bar. Ew. All units. All units. 1199. Expedite cover code 3. Deacon Mental Hospital. 184 copy. Code 3. ETA 3 minutes. Copy 184. Sorry, detectives. I know you're just coming off a case, but I'm afraid we're gonna have to make a detour. Sounds serious. Is it a riot? A call went out just before I picked you up. Said it was multiple homicides. Half a dozen units already on scene. 131, please advise. Hey, maybe it's the ghost of that doctor who went schizo and chopped up all those patients. That's not what happened. Some patients disappeared. Some kind of scandal? Still, gives you the creeps, doesn't it? 127, 124, please respond. Joseph, you think there's a connection? It's a possibility. I believe the records were sealed. Anyone on scene, respond. Dispatch, this is Detective Castellanos in 184. What's the situation? Over. 184, be advised. Some problem with the It's on a seat. a memorial on the Is there any... God damn it! Jesus! Junior Detective Kidman. Any thoughts? Nothing yet. I'm sure we'll know everything once we get there. Contact dispatch and let them know what's happening. Joseph, Kidman, you're with me. We're gonna have a look around. Right. It's very pretty. Oh yeah, I like the letterbox format too. It's very horror style. Uh, okay. So was it just my imagination, or is are the chick's eyes purple? I'll have to have a look. I didn't actually notice that. They were I was totally busy admiring this guy. Look, I mean, he's got a... It's weird. He's got, like, this undone shirt. He's got, like, a vest and a tie. And the coat's... He's a pretty nice coat. My name's Detective Scruffy. Detective Handsome Scruffy. This guy's like, I'm so glad I get to stay outside. I like the water effects on his coat. Oh, yeah. It's actually... It's getting wetter. Like, it's gotten progressively more soaked along the road here. Yep. He looks party. 
feel like you know, my buttons do anything yet, so. I mean, it's, it, considering we're. Oh. Oh. I was about to say, considering we're recording at 60 frames per second, it's playing very well, and then it's like chunk. Yeah, we'll have to see. We've got everything on max right now, so depending on how it goes with the recording. There's a lot of cop cars here, no cops. They're all eaten already. Yeah. A lot of debris, too. Huh. You know, if you leave your door open like that, you're gonna be sitting on a wet seat when you get back. Don't think these guys are gonna come back. Oh, you do think they're eaten. Probably, it's a horror game. This is how these things work. Yeah, but I'm hoping that, you know, they're not just eaten already. You've gotta like build up to the eating. You know, Purple work eyes. up an appetite. Are they? they look blue. Okay, not on her boobs. They look blue. Oh, they're, no, they are purple. They're totally Wait, is friggin' she a heterochromia? Purple, no. No, they're both purple, okay. She also has a touch of, like, the Uncanny Valley, because her okay, face is so... Okay, that's a really cool touch. Smooth compared... What? He's actually take, he's taking his glasses off to clean them because of the rain. Hmm. That's neat. Well, I don't think there's anything to be found out here. Ah. Smells like blood. All right, stay sharp. Apparently We're gonna check it out. Don't let anyone else through this door. I can be an extra set of eyes. We don't know what's happening here. You're a backup. So I'm just gonna point out that they put the chick in a white shirt in the rain. Yeah. Yeah, totally eaten. No, they're not eaten, they're dead. There's like still parts of them together. Nothing's been chewed or something. On. Jesus. Wow. This was kind of a mess. Mm -hmm. alive in here. Is this? No, oh, I thought his neck was completely turned around. Ew. Oh hey. Got a survivor. Just means he's the killer. Are you injured? What happened here? Can't be real. Impossible. Rufik is... I've got him. The security cameras might tell us something. As I can go, viewers. Huh. Cheery. So I'm getting the feeling that this is like one of those feel good games. Oh, 
Aw, he lost your jacket. And his gun. We also lost our music. I have a feeling you'd figured that out already. <laughs> You should ask him for directions. No, nope, I'm good. I think you're probably gonna have to shank him. Think so? I think so. There's some weird acoustics going on right now with that uh, music. Oh, he got, he's gone. Oh, okay. But where did he... I hear him, though. Oh, shit. <laughs> Uh, Smack. Uh, wow. So, uh, this don't game. hold my hand or anything, game. No kidding. No punches pulled here. Mm -hmm. Damn. Yeah, I think you're gonna have to either sneak Pat, like, up on him and shank him. Pretty sure you saw me. <laughs> you are the worst thief ever. <laughs> Alright, so obviously the game's not gonna let me kill him with the knife. Okay, so. <laughs> so we'll uh... crouch, wait for him to leave, and then quickly grab the keys. Yes, and then get out of there. You know, the funny thing is, if you'd been on the other side of him, like if the keys had been on the other side, it wouldn't have mattered because he would have turned away from you. Also, I, I think this guy's just misunderstood. I just think he just has a lot of dental work that he's working through. Oh, you think so? Yeah, that's why he's wearing the headgear. Well, there he goes. He's, I see where he is now. I don't know what he got. But yeah, not a lot of time there, is there? Might be because we're on the uh, survival difficulty. True. That's not loud at all. Um, close it behind you and lock it, silly. It's closed at least. Yeah. Okay. What does that mean? I don't know. There you go. That worries me. Had he left? Oh, hell. Tripwire? Seriously? Shit. Oh, good. You upgraded. And you run like a damaged gazelle. Well, he was. So graceful. What? How is he not dead after that? No kidding, eh? Uh, run. Or pop. Alright then. Oh my god, what is going on? This is the worst place. <laughs> Well, that's gonna be infected. Oh, no kidding. I like the fact he's so badly hobbled by that. Uh, yeah. I would think that you would be ho badly hobbled by a chainsaw to the back, too. In yeah, fact, I think you'd be worse hobbled. 
Yeah, but think of all the crap that most heroes go through in action games, right? They just walk it off. Oh, no, I'm just gonna, like, crouch behind this barricade for, like, five seconds and let my vision come back. <laughs> Too much jam. What does that mean? I don't know. I'm sure the game will tell me. Can I crouch? Oh, <laughs> wow. Like, big points to this game so far. It's a bit... I, I, okay, well, I would like it more if his leg was, like, visibly damaged, but... Hmm. I've been pretty impressed so far. It's very pretty. Which, I feel kind of weird saying that, but... Like, it's a very pretty ugly game. It's just like you. I'm not a game. It's true. Hospital sewers. I don't see anything worth. Like, nothing's standing out or shiny, so I'm just gonna get the hell out of this water. Uh, you do realize we're in a sewer level, right? Oh, yeah, this game's really pulling no punches when it starts off. Sewer level. Oh, hey, look! A friendly chap in a wheelchair. And a door. Where's the exit? Old note from sewer. Beside the lock gate at the far end of the sewer, there is a ladder which would take you to the old ward. If you could make it through there, you would find an elevator leading outside. You would be the one who escaped. You might be the one who survived. R. Well, let's... Is that R for red herring? Because there's no way we're getting out of this that quick. Uh, could be R for Ruvik, but Ruvik is not real? Really? Nothing in here? Doesn't look like it. Huh. Alright, well. It looks exhausting to walk like that. Oh, probably. Well, this looks kind of, you know, painful. Uh, kind of the axe to the leg. I mean, axe, no, chainsaw, chainsaw to the leg. Wait, wait, wait. Is there anything? No, that's. Oh, it's barred. As far as all across it. That looks like razor wire. Nope. And that's also more. No oh, that's double noped. Maybe you need an ion torch. Oh god, really? We're gonna reference that now? It's been so dated. What do you mean dated? We like just finished it. Yeah, but they don't know that. Well, they do now. But it doesn't make any sense. You can't just reference that. I try not to do that in my regular LPs because, oh man. Oh, yes. Oh, there's the wound. Oh, it's like down on his calf. And he's not using it to climb. I'm wow. Like that. That's a really nice attention to detail. The guy reaches down and like grabs you by the head. You should have crouched and snuck. If he got ahead of you, I'd be kind of impressed. Ooh. That didn't look good. I see something we get to read. Boiler room note. One o'clock. STEM op system operation test begins. One fifteen. Success. Confirmation of brainwave synchronization. Losses minimal. Continuing experiment. Agents collect the data. Um, one. Hey. Oh. What? What? The mouse scroll didn't work. Escape is that archive. <laughs> This thing here? Tab? Probably the one. There you go. Blue note. Okay. Uh, 1.30 anomaly occurs. Not with the subject. The stenographer claimed that they weren't feeling well and then fell into a coma for reasons unknown. Doctor orders the stem system terminated. I seriously can't scroll down with this. It's the mouse wheel is actually not working. Okay. I don't know what to tell you. Page down, maybe? No. I feel like figuring out how to scroll would not be that tough, but yeah. apparently. All right. Well, uh, hmm. We'll deal with it later. We'll come yeah. back to that. We'll figure it out later, viewers. So obviously the stem is some kind of brainwave 
synchronization. Pull the alarm later here. Yeah, no kidding. It's a fire, really. Also, I like how the uh, the loading or that thing up in the corner is like a lobotomy thing. Jug a random thing. Boxes of stuff. God, hospitals are gross. And nowhere is gauze and a needle to be found. Oh, that probably needs a staple gun. Although, really, do you want to use gauze and a needle if you find it here? Just disinfect it. Uh, I feel like you want to get somewhere where you're not in front of a door. Let's try this. Hey, it's Outlast. this way. Maybe at least get an alternate exit. Or something. Uh, no. I think you're gonna have to follow him. Can I hide in there? You really are thinking like Outlast. Yeah, and because I'm pretty sure I can't fight him right now. Oh, I'm so dead. Probably. The good news is, like, honestly, if this were a real situation, there's no way he would hear you over the chains. Shit. Uh, I'm sorry. <gasps> Foil! He's just gonna come through. This is silly. Shit. Oh, foil. Um, I have no idea what to do now. I think just hobble. That looks important. Yeah, did look important. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so. Oh. He's gonna play cat and mouse for a while. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I would love to, but he's not exactly at, you know, Olympic level sprinting mode right now. Alright, so I live here now. Okay. That's Thanks for watching, viewers. It's going to be pretty boring LP. Oh, no, I'm done. That's it. Come on, what? game. How did he see you? And like, this is the stupid part because now it's just like. 
to yeah, it's like, what do I do? Just really raging. Man. Oh no, no. sorry. No. That's what I was saying. I think he was trying to get you like through the wall. Well, I see this becoming very frustrating. Indeed. Especially because like your mobility is such ass right now. No, apparently trying to wait and be clever was just kind of silly. Can't let him see me. Yeah, no yeah, crap. Yeah, thank you for that. Now remember, he does walk over to the side. And you can't get through here. enough time if you hesitate yeah I just I wish I had more tools to use like they said throwing bottles can distract an enemy well that's great I don't even have any of those yet and I haven't been able to pick any up so like what do you want from me I guess just book it last time. look if he's got a set pattern I guess I can figure it out but yeah it's kind of lame you can't let him see me yeah we figured that out Well, and the one issue is he does seem to be, you know, he will not be able to hobble around that corner fast enough. So he's going to bust the ball off the box. Oh my god, you and this camera. I'm trying to keep it on him. I know, but I feel like... We didn't, which means his pattern's actually random. Uh, well, if he comes through this door again, you're screwed. Oh my god. Where 
is he going? I think he had to clear the path for you too. Maybe. No, I really do think so. Because I think there was a box there and I think he destroyed it for you. Okay. Oh my god, closed doors quieter. No kidding. Yay. Can you pick up that bottle? No, it's not shiny. Mm. Oh, wheelchairs. You could use one of those right now. <laughs> no kidding. What? Shit. What? What? I gotta check. I like how he's politely waiting for you now. Well, that was nice of the elevator to activate for you. I couldn't blame you after that. Find myself with an <laughs> prologue. Darkness twisting me around. There is nothing I can do. And there's Still chapter one? Yeah, emergency call. Okay. Well, I mean, technically we haven't escaped yet. No, we walked it off. Uh, okay. Maybe he just, like, bound it up. Jesus. Well, that's the thing. <laughs> oh, this is the hallway where those, these were the three cops that were killed. Okay, now you run. Are you supposed to get out of here? Maybe. It does seem to be kind of collapsing. No, no. Front door. Any door? Well, preferably front door, but... But I mean, I guess if you want to, like, look for files or something. Not really. Then your sense of direction is terrible. Terrible. Don't see anything shining, do you? Sorry, but you never came out. 
I'd waited, but... Uh, please, settle uh, down, Leslie. Settle down, Leslie. Settle down, Leslie. Settle down, Leslie. Shit! There's no going back. from everyone everyone must be dead everyone all right back there just a few bumps we're fine 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 we will be once we're fine. far away fine a little further and we'll be fine 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 fall fall That's a crappy start. Gotta be a Monday. Definitely. Chapter oh. 2, Remnants. And we'll see that when we come back, viewers. So, thanks for watching. See you next time.